Hey, and here with Pearls and Paseco. I'm back for the second part of our unboxing, our Shop Goodwill unboxing. So this is the second part of the $54 box that came from Los Angeles. And I have arranged all of the one earrings um, and cufflinks up at the top so we can figure out where their mates are. And I did finally get this piece untangled, which turned out to be really cool. So it's feathers and jasper, red jasper pieces. I'm not really sure if it would sell. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet, but it is pretty cool. So I thought I'd show it to you. And I wanted to show you some other things that I finally got. I got to research, even though I wasn't done yet with the bag. So this bangle ended up being Baker Light, and it is a Kathy and Marsha Kathleen Stern bangle. So that ended up being really cool. She's a big New York designer. And these earrings, I'm going to take them out again. And these are the ones that, ooh, bag noises. I'll take one out. So they're called Tangerine Ball Earrings, and they are... Um, Diane von Furstenberg, I believe. Anyway, so she is a Belgium designer. And yes, they do sell for $98 or more. And there was actually a picture of Princess Catherine wearing them. So that was a score. All right. So now I'm back for the second part of this huge bag. I'll get a little space to work. out a little bit at a time. Oh, there is so much dirt in here. Okay, so this is part of a $200 Nordstrom watch. Wouldn't it be nice if we could actually find the watch? Monopoly Black. Hmm, maybe the watch will be in here. Huh, okay, well I'm gonna put this over to the side. Maybe we'll be lucky and find the watch. Who knows? <laughs> This is a broken piece of porcelain. And oh, it would have been so cool if the whole we'd had the whole thing. Oh, maybe it's in here somewhere. I don't see it, but that would have been so cool if we had the whole thing. That's so pretty. <clears throat> I'll just move him over to the side. Okay. Got some more bangles. These bangles are really pretty. I put these in. I have a bangle lot. Oh, this is a pretty earring. Let's see if we can find the partner. He's kind of a coppery with flowers. He'd actually make a really cool ring. You'd probably bend him around your finger and make a ring with him. Oh, and a flower that's missing all of its stones. Poor flower. So he's going to go in a craft lot. And if you're curious, my craft lots are jewelry that for whatever reason I have decided not to sell. Um, it might be broken. It might be something that I just don't think is going to sell. It might be something, you know, that's not fashionable or that I can't um, sell and get a good return on. But so I sell those um, craft lots on Etsy and they make really good bags of beads or pieces of metal or things that you can build new cool stuff with. So this is a cool bangle. I thought I saw a 925 mark on it. That's why I keep turning it around, but it doesn't have one. But it is really, really good condition. So I'm going to keep it for my bangle lot. And there's another bangle. And it doesn't have any markings in it either, but it is really pretty too. Oh, it's got some hair in it. It's got little, little flowers. Man, these nice bangles. And here's another bangle. Uh, let's see. And no mark on it either, but it's got kind of a cool little, I don't know if it'll focus. It's got a cool little design in it. So those will make good additions to my craft lot. All right. Ooh, now this is cool. And this is definitely vintage. It's a fork. And it's enameled. And he's kind of a coppery color. Ah, oh, 
He's definitely vintage. I wonder if we'll find a spoon. That would be awesome. Put him in my sale pile. <laughs> and then this earring. Let's see if we find a mate to it. But I really, I like these beads. If we don't find a mate, this will definitely be a good addition to a craft lot. A little hair clip. Mm, boy, that's a strong hair clip. Oh. So he will go in a craft lot for someone to love. Oh, that's cool. It's a little diamond. Or sorry, I can't talk today. <laughs> I just got out of the longest meeting ever. And I, I can't think. I can't word. Triangle shaped. And it's really nasty. And I'll tell you, the last time I had one that was this nasty, I cleaned it up and it ended up being sterling. So I won't discount him yet. And here's a little, a little teddy bear and some loose stones and a loose rubber band. Let's see, and a loose button and another loose stone. Any other loose stones? Another loose stone. Oh, that's an earring. Okay, so these will go to a craft lot along with this awesome little fashion ring. A little ship wheel. He's cool. Maybe we'll find a partner. And a wing. And this guy looks like he has been beaten up. <laughs> but he does have markings on him, so let's see. He is a California... Seagal, L-H, Seagal, California. Hmm, never heard of that. Hmm, well, we'll put him over here and see if we find a mate. More trash. I had to move my trash can closer because this lot is full of it. So this little earring has a little, um, a little black rose on it. Oh, and a tangled, very, very little tangled. Very, very tangled, very, very tangled. A very tangled little locket. Well, let's look at the locket. It's very pretty. Little flower design. It's almost like an Asian, more like a, oh, nobody inside. Um, it looks like, um, oh, I can't think of it. Cherry blossoms. I don't know why I can't think of it. Okay. More than likely, he's going to a lot anyway, so I'm not going to waste my time on that. All right, so here's a watch, and it is a quartz pegot. P e u g e o t pegot. I can't pronounce words. I don't word. Um, it's pretty nice. We'll put a battery in it and see if it works. It's genuine calf skin Handley Roma Hadley Roma hmm I don't know. okay so we'll I'll take a, a closer look at this and see if it's worth putting a battery in and if it is we'll sell it and if it's not it will go into my watch lot oh my gosh angry birds god these watches are huge Angry Birds. I don't know if there's a market for Angry Birds. He does have a scratch on the front. Um, I don't know. I'm going to list. I'm going to list. <laughs> I'm not going to list. I'm going to research him. And if there is a market for Angry Birds still, then I'll try to sell him. That is a thick piece of glass. But if not, then he also will go into my watch lot. Oh, I saw this earlier. Youth to the people. Hmm. What does that mean? Youth to the people. I have no idea. But I keep these pens um, to using cork boards. So I'm going to put him over in my pile for now. Oh, this is a pretty earring. I hope he has a mate. He is really pretty. Kind of like cat's eye and then like little brown cat's eye. He has a, let's see. Oh, 925. 925 Sterling. So if I can't find his mate, he is Sterling, but I really would like to find his mate. All right, here's another one of these tie pins with a dove. I'm pretty sure these are tie pins. 
um, and not like a hat clip, but correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, so this is a delicate little, uh, it's got like a piece of chain has attached itself. Oh, la la la. Okay, he'll go to a craft lot. Okay, so these are little pearls with little rhinestones in between. And let's see, there's not a maker's mark, and it's cute, but I'm not really into the wire necklaces. They don't really sell very well, so I'm going to throw him in a crafter lot. And a bracelet with no clasp. <laughs> So, and he feels very plasticky. So he's gonna go into a crafter lot. Oh, this is cute. It's a little metal flower on a hammered metal base. And I've, I've noticed people like hammered metal. A leaf? At least it's a green leaf. He's pretty cool. Okay, I'll put him over there. I really hope I find some of the matches, okay. This is Chico's whenever I get it untangled. I've had lots of Chico stuff. And I've had lots of Chico stuff sell recently. Oh my. Oh my. This is going to be something. All right, you move over there. Oh, little pieces of stuff. Oh, isn't he sweet? He is a real Aurora Borealis. So, so sweet. Oh, I'd love to find another one of that. And this just looks like a piece. Maybe it came off the top of a watch or... I'm not sure, but he'll look cool somewhere. And a craft lot. So this earring I have the mate for. And they're really cool. It little asymmetrical kind of little earrings. And I hope my light is good. I can't see the camera right now. A little hair clippy. <laughs> a little bow clip. Boop, 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 boop. Well, it looks like a little, like a seagull. Do, 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 do. <laughs> so he's going to go in a craft lot. And... Oh my, what a mess. Let's just see what I can get loose. There we go. Okay. What in the blue blazes is this thing? And he's got some trash. Okay. What is this? It's just a beaded tassel. And I can't tell. It looks like maybe a string came loose there. It's just a big beaded tassel. What would you do with a big beaded tassel? I don't know. I mean, it's it's certainly not a key ring. Oh, and this little chain is broken. Oh, it is cool for tassels. As tassels go, it's a pretty cool little tassel. So he's going to go in a craft lot, and I would love to see what somebody, he's throwing beads on my table. I would love to see what somebody comes up with with this thing. I'd love to see what they make it. I feel like when I do craft lots, I want to ask people, like, send me pictures of what you end up making. I want to see. So this must have been part of a necklace with feathers and little wooden pieces and little leather strips and little faceted beads. Are there any other feathers in here? I am not sure, so he will go. Yeah, I do see another feather, but it's a different color. He will go in a craft lot. Up oh, and another one of these bracelets. Brace healthy, brace healthy, brace Heidi. I don't know. I hope they sell well because that's like the fourth one, and I think I saw another one in there. So. Okay, is it that we have this 
safety pinned the reason that I'm having trouble here? This oh trying to shake without shaking everything loose breaking it. Okay. This is an earring. If I can get him loose. <laughs> he is really caught up in here. Let's see. You go that way and you come that way. Okay. So this is like an earring that's a little origami box. No idea. I'm going to move him over there. And this is an earring 